students, all my beloved friends, the teachers of St. Angela Senior High School. Let us prepare ourselves to join the liturgy of work this morning. Let us come into this liturgy by singing the anthem song. Chapter 14, verse 22 
decide why he sent the people away. After sending the people away, he went up into the hill by himself to pray. When evening came, he was then alone. While the boat was far out from land, was hard pressed by rough waves, for the wind was blowing against him. Between three and six o'clock, Jesus came to the disciples walking on the water, and when the disciples saw him, they were terrified. It is a ghost, they said, and cried out in fear. But at once Jesus called out to them, saying, Courage, it's me, don't be afraid. It was Peter who answered, Lord, he said, if it is you, tell me to come to you across the water. Jesus said, Come. Then Peter got out of the boat and started walking towards Jesus across the water. But when he noticed the strong wind, he was afraid and began to sink. Lord, he cried, Save me. Jesus put out his hand at once and helped Peter. You have so little faith, he said. Why did you doubt? And as they got into the boat, the wind died down. Then the disciples in the boat bowed down before Jesus and said, Truly, you are the Son of God. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Of St. Fujiana, St. High School. All my love students, I begin my homily today by saying the title of the homily is The Divinity of Jesus or The Divinity of of Christ. My beloved students, you were so young in age, but uh, now you are adolescents. You know, when you find from the YouTube, you can find so many people, the false teacher misleading the people by teaching the wrong things. Such a kind of thinking fallacy. They try to mislead the people by saying, Jesus is not God. Jesus is only human. But here in the Bible today, you see, Jesus walks on the water. That's one of the proof. Just Jesus is truly God. Jesus is not human. Jesus is not only human. He come from the Father. He come from God. And take the flesh of humankind to suffer, to redeem us from our sins. Many miracles that Jesus did, we can say that Jesus heals the blind, heals the blind, Jesus rose Lazarus from death back to life. Jesus walked from the water. And so on and so forth. That proves that Jesus is God. Jesus is not only human. But you know, many people try to say that. Prove to me. Show me from the Bible. Where Jesus said, I am God, or seek me. Where? There is no proof in the Bible. Jesus never says that he is God and or seek him. But everything proves that he is God. And from the confession of the mouth of the disciples, when Jesus walks on water, what, what did the disciples say? They say, truly, you are the Son of God. So what is the Son of God? 
if Jesus is not God, why did the disciples say that you are the Son of God? So, my students, my beloved students, and all my friends, when you watch from the YouTubes, from the televisions, some people come from, from some famous one, from some famous name, I don't want to mention their name, they say, Jesus is not God. Show me where Jesus said that he is God. Worship me. Jesus never said that. Yes. Yes, of course. Indeed, Jesus never said that. But how did Thomas say, Oh my, oh my Lord, and oh my God. And Jesus answered, Because you see me and you believe. But be glad for those who do not see me. But believe. That's many miracles and many proofs which proves that Jesus is really God. In the Godhead of the Trinity, we the church believe the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Okay, all of my beloved friends and students today to go deeper into the Bible. I have prepared five questions for you, especially for those uh, I love of uh, the students. Question number one is, what is the Bible today? I just want to check whether you understand the Bible today or not. They should have answered the questions. The Bible today is about Let, give me the answer. Jesus walks on the water. Jesus walks on the water. Like he's walking on the dry land. That's a kind of miracle. You know miracle? Miracle in Indonesian we call Kenzaipa or Mujisa. That's what we call miracle in Indonesia. And why Jesus could walk on the water? Number two. First and number two. Hello. Can anybody tell me why Jesus would walk on the water? Because, because he is the Son of God. That's why he could walk on the water. There is no human can walk on the water. I've never seen that. Number three, why could he put walk on the water like this deep? Why? Why could he put a walk? Because Peter is just human. And he has little, little what? Jesus said, you have so little faith. Because he has little faith. Just like you and me. If we have faith, just as being the master sheep, we can move the mountain and throw it into the sea. But unfortunately, we don't have it. Have you seen the miracles in your life? Yes or no? Have you seen the miracles in your life? Yes, of course. We have seen the miracles through our whole life. <clears throat> through the technology, through the social life. Jesus' miracle still exists until today. You know, many people out there heals the people by saying Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus of Nazareth, heals. And the same. Besides Jesus walks on the water. Jesus, uh, Jesus changes the water. 
Yes, Jesus changed the water into the wine in the in a wedding in Cana. And then one more. Jesus heals heals what? Heals the blind. Jesus heals the blind. Jesus heals the blind. And Jesus rise from death. Resurrection. And ascension into heaven. Ascend into heaven. That's those kind of miracles. Not only proof that Jesus is God, but they are built our faith in Jesus. So, my students and my friends, don't believe those liars which tell us Spread the lies, spread the lie in the YouTube and in the through the social media and some kind of that. Don't believe them because they are only a big fat liar. They are only liar. Okay, in the name of Jesus. <coughs> Strengthen our disciples 
happiness to other people. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. That's all we have prayed for. The day of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. The liturgy is end. Let us go to love one another. Oh, oh.